Hi, I'm Carla. I'm Philippe. And this is week one here at Wednesday Night Hop. Level two. two. Level two. Level two. For April 2015. Mixing six count and eight count patterns. That's right. So first thing we did was just kind of clean up your footwork. Working on a six count rhythm and eight count, I'll do it this way so we can follow along. So we went one, two, three, and four, and five, and six. And we talked about emphasizing your pulse and making sure you're really clear on the catch and the redirect. And then we took this and we made it into eight counts. One, two, a three, and four, five, six, six. seven, eight. And we also did these both side to side. So we did six counts side to side, redirect. And then we also did our eight counts side to side. Five, six, and seven, eight, one. Yeah, good practice. Yeah. yeah. We quickly kind of put that in a closed position with you guys. Maybe we'll do it yeah, we did just like a, this. Yeah, we did this promenade, this V position. So we've got the six count version. And then we also tried the eight count version, really emphasizing taking our time there on the five, six. And we talked about false, making sure that you keep your back in your leader's arms so that you're staying with your leader and not losing him on that forward momentum. A little bit glued. Yes. Yeah. Then, we, uh, then we did a little eight count, six count pattern. So we did a circle. That's eight counts. And then we did a six count tuck turn. Just mixing those rhythms. Those, that little sequence is probably one of the most common things I feel on the social dance floor. Eight count circle to a six count tuck turn. And super fun. And super fun. And then we switched it up a little bit and we did a six count circle followed by a six count tuck turn. And we made sure you could lead the difference between those. Focusing again on that and triple step. Yes. And followers waiting for it, not anticipating eight or six. Then, some passes. Yes. Some side passes. So well, these are right side passes. Leader's right side. Mine also. One, two, three, and four, five, and six. Then we did it with a hand switch. We're both One, two, passing three, by, both five, traveling. And, six. and then we added another side pass. Oh, one, two, three, three and four, five, and six. six. One, One, two, two Three and, and four, four five, five, six, six seven, seven and eight. eight. So we added a little outside turn there, extending your side pass into an eight count. The turn takes two counts. One, two, three, and four. Down the line. And I stay with Carla so that we don't get too far away from each other. Yeah, Falls, you're using the rhythm of the pulse, pulse to di direct the steps that you're taking down the line there. And we changed that up a little bit. And we did a six count One, version. One, two, three, and four, and five, and six. Let's so do it from this yeah. side too, so you can see it. One, two, three, and four, five, and six. So Falls, what's happening here is your leader's gonna give you a little bit of a quicker turn. There's a big prep on the three and four. The arm's out like you're kind of having a hula hoop around your follower. And then we're going and Please. five and six. So you're turning on your second triple step, very tight turn under you. The majority of the travel happens on your first One, two, three, triple three, step, four. triple yes. step, and your second triple's more on the spot for that, for that turn. Yeah. So that was your first class for mixing six and eight. We're gonna build on that for the next four weeks, and I think you guys did a really good job. It's gonna be super fun. We'll see you next week. Bye.